The Adelaide Strikers have won here. That's gone, gone, yeah, that's gone. <laughs>Well, for the Strikers, I think the first thing in their favour is that they've been able to train. Lockdowns all around the country, but the players in Adelaide have had that freedom, which is absolutely magnificent. But we've just got some bad news through. So, Susie Bates, who didn't play last season after the injuring her shoulder, isn't back. Likewise, Stefani Tail. So, two big names out of the Strikers squad. They need to be able to find replacements for them pretty quickly. Point bowls and it's worked away. That's the winning run! Well, they missed out on the finals by one game last season. And when you look at a player coming into the team, I think if she comes in, they could be well and truly in finals. And that's the South African skipper in Van van Meerkirk. Because you look at her history, when she joins teams, teams do pretty well. She joined the Sixers, they won the title. She joined the Surrey Stars, they won the title. And this year in the 100, she joined the Oval Invincibles. And guess what? Yep, they won the title. So I think the Adelaide Strikers will be hoping that she can bring that form to them this season. Lots of air, it's a full toss, and it's been put down. No, it hasn't! It's unbelievable! I'm going to be a little bit cheeky. I'm not going to go one, I'm going to go two players for Adelaide Strikers this year. Talia McGrath and also Amanda Jade Wellington. Two players that have sort of knocked on the door of being one of those really consistent big-name players in WBBL. And I think this season might be just it for them. That has gone like an absolute tracer bullet. I reckon, and it's given. Power play, tick, tick. I think with Megan Shude and Darcy Brown with the ball, and then with particularly Laura Vulvard at the top of the order with Talia McGrath, I think they can get the runs in the power play as well. It's all about the middle overs for me. So overs seven through to 16, if they can do the bulk of the work in there off the back end of the power play, then they can set themselves up for the last four. They'll definitely be knocking on their final store. The strikers absolutely love it. WBBL, oh, it just keeps on giving.